Hi there, I'm Anna, and in this video I will show you how I finish off my crochet toys. So I have this detail, and I work until I have 12 stitches in my last row. So I add the stuffing material, and here you can see the 12 stitches. So I finish off this uh, piece of yarn, so I unravel the loop and I'm going to insert into my sewing needle here. Now what I'm going to do is I will be inserting the needle inside the front loop of the two first stitches. So here I have the first stitch, second stitch, front loop only, pull the yarn, and again you're going to take only the front loop of the stitch. If you don't know what is the front loop and the back loop, check the link below in the description, there is a blog post with all the information that you need to know. What I'm doing here now is inserting the needle two by two stitches. So I grab the first loop of one stitch, the front loop of the second stitch, pull the yarn and do the same again. So I'll be doing this six times, right? Because I have 12 stitches, so two by two, I will do it six times. Very nice math, I'm so smart. <laughs> okay, so here we finish all of them, pull it very tight, and you see, you already close your crochet, okay? So now, to make it nicer, what we are going to do is insert the sewing needle, taking two by two stitches, but this time you can take the whole stitch. Okay? Let's do it again. This you can do continuously until you find there is nice and symmetrical looking to you. The secret here is to have 12 stitches on your last row. This is very important because this is what is going to make it look like even and nice, you know, most looking like the beginning because the beginning is very neat. Now you insert the needle on the central part and in somewhere out there in the middle of some stitches, pull the yarn and to fasten off and to make it secure just do it a couple of more times. You see it's invisible, you cannot see the stitch there. Just one more time, I think it's enough. Yes, okay, that's it. I'm going to cut this remaining piece of yarn. And we are done. This is the beginning and this is the end. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it was useful for you to help you how to finish off your crochet toy. And if you have any question, leave it in the comment box below. I will be super happy to reply to you. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!